गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट माई सेल्फ ही विनय शर्मा फ्रॉम मेपल्स अकेडमी देवबंद सहारनपुर टूडे वी विल डिस्कस द फर्स्ट पोएम ऑफ क्लास इलेवन इंग्लिश बुक ऑन बिल द पोएम्स नेम इज ए फोटोग्राफ एंड द पोएट्स नेम इज शर्ले टॉलसन नाउ वी विल हैव द स्नोपिस ऑफ द पोएम द पोएम ए फोटोग्राफ इज ए ट्रीब्यूट टू द पोएट्स मदर The poem describes three stages in the passage of time. In first stage, the poet's mother is described as a twelve-year-old girl with a sweet and innocent smile. In second stage, the poet's mother's middle age is described, while the third stage describes the poet's feelings. For her mother, who has died many years ago. Now we will discuss the poem in detail. Now this is the summary of the poem, a photograph. The poem begins when the poetess goes through her mother's photo that lay within the cardboard boxes. They were possibly uncared for some time. In addition, it is not in any frame, metal, etc. so the poetess portrays it as being susceptible to forces of decay in the photo poetess mother seems aged by her siblings who are younger than her also she highlights her mother's strength as she supports her young cousins they all look into the camera when their brother uncle photograph them moreover they look happy and excited with their throwing locks and pleasant smiles further the picture shows the sea waves smashing at them as the young girls learn to keep up with the waves she remain she remains with the thought that sea even in motion her mother that is motionless in the photograph is able to resist the change as she has surrendered herself to mortality in the second phase in her older age her mother looks back the day at the sea moreover she remembers her two cousins and recalls the day memo realized in the photograph also she makes fun of her and her cousins outfits these lines have a tone of sadness as the mother tries to accept the continual motion of life as she grows older looking back at her 12 year old self maybe was an attempt to return to her childhood which is a painful reminder of time and age in the third part the poetess remembering her mother as she died earlier further the photo script a memory for both as it notes the mother and daughter together even after her mother had left her for forever the poetess confesses that the photo bliss at imagining her mother's laughter much like her mother delight in remembering the day at the sea moreover she notices that the time over since her mother final departure is the same as her age in the photograph that is 12 years maybe it is a coincidence or an irony of life and death eventually both poetess and her mother learn to accept the change and make peace with their memories even though they remind them of the briefness of laughter happy moment etc although the death or end makes things go quiet and empty however the poetess find her mother death to be loud and inspiring enough to pour her feelings out in the form of a tribute in the poem 
thus even though death finishes everything but her mother's death brings out a new response in her lastly she accepts silently her resignation to the final silence of death so conclusion of a photograph summary in a photograph summary the poetess wants to say that death is unavoidable so embrace your life so this was the summary of the poem a photograph thank you very much